respected parents and my dear students i am the principal speaking as you are aware we are still in the corona period and it is not going to go away that easily experts are saying that the corona is going to be a part of life as well so the best is to learn to live with the virus and find a solution to overcome this problem together as per the present situation there is an uncertainty when schools and colleges will reopen coronavirus pandemic has significantly disrupted various sectors in india we can't ignore that hardly a sector would remain unaffected by the crisis but one sector which i believe is affected maximum is the education sector no doubt this is a crucial time for education sector because of the entrance test of various universities and competitive examinations are held during this period along with them how can we forget about the board council examinations hs admissions etc even if these days pass then closure of schools and colleges does not even have short term impact in india but can even cause far reaching economic and societal consequences let us tell you that due to the close down of educational institutes it is estimated to affect around 600 million learners around the world remember here we are talking about the school going students only the closure of educational institutions niche worldwide has severely hit students parents teachers reeling from the shock of this unprecedented disaster they may be wondering what is the future of education and i think one key area of transformation will be the area of education virtual education will revolutionize school education because such students have a higher adaptability to technology and online portals even for school education from physical classrooms education is being forced to move online this may hence for just become the norm however those educational institutions that do not adapt to their digital teaching may even be rendered uncompetitive and operationally unsustainable people are responding heroically parents are working from home teachers are creating an entire new way of doing their jobs not to mention the kids themselves stuck inside without their friends somehow we will get through this and when we do how things look when school starts again after weeks or months at at home students will have lost their parents face to face support many young people will have experienced poverty and stress they may have seen family members become ill or worse they might have had little chance to play outside many children will have lost their habits that the school teach them such as standing in order waiting your turn knowing how to listen and cooperate more than a few will exhibit the signs of post traumatic stress and the learning gaps will undoubtedly widen between children from poorer and better off homes although governments may be anticipating upcoming austerity but we will actually need additional resources we will need teachers to help the weakest learners and most vulnerable children settle down and catch up it's now clear that without their teachers care and support it's hard for many young people to stay well and focused 
being well we will appreciate isn't an alternative to being successful it's an essential precondition for achievement especially among our most vulnerable children teachers are among the unsung heroes of covid-19 preparing resources and guidance for remote learning connecting with kids and their parents to make sure they are okay even while many have kids of their own at home parents are fast coming to appreciate everything their teachers do it's hard enough when parents have two or three kids at home all day now many will surely realize just how hard it must be to have so many in a class once the working world regains a degree of normality we won't take our essential workers for granted so much teachers will be among these during covid-19 there's been a mad scramble to find technology to support learning at home this stimulated school to evolve evolve in many ways in which innovation and deeper learning not just technology are in the foreground we certainly need better digital resources but anyone who thought that online learning can replace teachers will be rapidly disabused of the idea we are in a long dark tunnel at the moment when we emerge our challenge will be to not proceed exactly as before but to reflect deeply on what we have experienced take a sharp turn in education and society for better we can't ignore that at this time of crisis effective educational practices needed for capacity building of young minds central government and state government are planning to take some measures to ensure the overall progress in the country but time never wait this tough time will also pass till then stay safe and stay at home thank you